Hello again and welcome back to Scott Review Things. And I have decided to come to what is purported to be the largest micro brew pub in the whole of Europe. Can you guess where I am? Let's find out here on Scott Review Things. So I've come, I'm in Peterborough, I've come to the Brewery Tap, which is the home of Oakham Brewery. So they have, obviously they have their own brewery, but the tap room is actually situated in the Westgate area of Peterborough, so not right by the um, brewery itself, but I absolutely love Citra. But what I'm hoping to get is a pint of Green Devil IPA, sadly lost to British supermarket. I think we've got a Thai restaurant in here as well. So, yeah, it's brewery tap, regular events, pub quiz, hey, funk it's Friday, Saturday night groove, and all sorts in between. I absolutely love the style of the place. It looks really good. So uh, let's go in and let's see if I can get a pint of Green Devil. Oh, okay. So still got the um, they've got the brew side. I don't know if this is still used. I'm assuming it's because it's a micro brew pub. The equipment too. It's really nice in here and design, isn't it? I like it. Here's my point. Point of the devil. So a very happy man. Uh, they've got Green Devil on. I should be on cask, um, draft, whichever way you want to call it. Um, a huge fan of Citra. Uh, I don't think I've had Jeffrey Hudson Bitter. Uh, and I know I haven't had Inferno. But the, the Green Devil, so obviously Citra was the first beer in the UK to use the Citra hops. And they've done a fantastic job of it. And obviously it exploded across across the UK after that, uh, with, with it become prevalent in a great deal of craft IPA. I um, can't remember what ABV Citra is, it's about 5%, and obviously the Green Devil, which is a slightly hopped up version of Citra, coming in at about 6%, so uh, £5.60 a pint. I'm hoping it's going to be really good. It just smells fantastic, hoppy, um, citrusy notes. It's like um, citra on steroids, but um, yeah. Oakham Ales Brewery Tap. Cheers. That is an absolute joyous beer. Um, if you, unless you don't like citra, obviously. But that is um, really hoppy, really fresh. Um, you get all those really lovely citrusy notes from it um, and real nice it's bordering on the bordering on the west coast bitterness as well which I absolutely obviously people that know me know I absolutely love a west coast IPA so this is um, an absolute treat for me I couldn't come to Peterborough and I know people gave me some uh, thank you very much apart from the people that said the best things about Peterborough are the road out get a taxi and get out of here. Um, I couldn't come to Peterborough, not come to Oakham Ales 
brewery tap room. I know people have been on about Blind Tiger, and there's a couple of other places as well. Um, but this was the one that I really wanted to come to because I have absolutely loved Citra. And it's a real shame that Green Devil isn't available in um, the supermarkets anymore. I think that's uh, an absolute travesty. But they've also got some... Uh, they've got Madri on for for the clinically uh, the clinically depressed amongst you. You can have a point at Madri. Um, they've, got, they've got Blue Moon, the Belgian Whip beer. I don't mind Blue Moon. That's it's not a not a horrendous beer. And obviously, they've got their own beers on. I think there's some stuff in bottles as well. I was hoping to pick up a couple of bottles of Green Devil, uh, but I can you can I think I can only buy them from the brewery. I have to buy twelve bottles, so thirty pounds. To be fair. I haven't got 30 quid, <laughs> well, I have, but I think Wanda might have something to say about that, so. But that's glorious. Everything that I remembered it to be, Green Devil, um, Poppy, and the, the, the use of Citra in that is absolutely spectacular. So yeah, if you come, if you come to Peterborough, rank the second shittiest place to live in, in, in Britain apparently, which find a bit harsh if I'm honest but you know some of them Portsmouth isn't much better so I'm not sort of saying anything different to that um who's going to Peterborough and you're like an oak male you've got to come you've got to come here because it's uh, it's got to be bucket list stuff isn't it I think so um yeah that cannot get anything less than a double thumbs up from me um if you I don't understand in the world we live in, whether it's something to do Oakham or the logistics, where they can get Citra into the the supermarkets, I don't understand why they can't get um, Green Devil in because it's it's a terrific beer. And you look at some of the shit on the shelves that we've got these days; it's an absolute bafflement to me, in all honesty. But um, I'm going to sit and enjoy that. Um, so if you come in, come to Peterborough, get yourself up to Oakham Ales, the Westgate area of Peterborough the um, Okamayo's Brewery Tap, it, you're not going to be disappointed. It's, um, they do Thai food, uh, lunch specials, chef specials, all sorts of stuff. Well worth a visit. If you've got anybody getting thumbs up, if you don't get a thumbs down, there's a subscribe button somewhere, and I'll see you very soon. I am slightly concerned here, guys, because uh, the website, and I, I shit you not, it says, uh, the Brewery Tap is one of the safest, safest, safest and best place late night venues in Peterborough. Now the fact they put it on the website needs to be to think, I'm gonna get killed on the way home. <laughs>